hey, uh, I'm not dead. No, I'm back. And today, I want to be transparent about something that's been uh, in the works, like uh, been I've been dealing with for a while. There's been some unforeseen complications to a certain event, so we're going to talk about that today. Because, as we all know, everyone who's involved with the Chosen wants to be completely transparent. That's just how it goes. So uh, I'm going to be completely transparent with you guys today, and uh, we're going to get to the bottom. I'm just kind of explaining this issue. So uh, let's go ahead and roll that intro. Yeah. All right, so as we all know, on the second week of July, which is less than a month away, it's coming up very, very quickly, The Chosen has graciously offered the opportunity for all of us fans to participate in being extras for the finale of Season 4, which is very exciting, and they love to do that, and it's just awesome when they decide to do these kinds of things. So in order to participate as an extra, uh, just to review you know you had to participate in the multiply campaign for the come and see foundation and start your own fundraising page and raise money to help the chosen fund season four and get more funds to the come and see foundation to help them translate the show into more and more languages and get the show out to more people which is great the chosen has just become i believe the most translated show like ever it passed baywatch which is pretty pretty exciting so that whole thing went down and uh as you guys know i raised six thousand dollars and the 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 multiply campaign i think is almost over like it's almost ended so i'm ending with around sixty three hundred dollars which is i cannot thank you guys enough for all of your support for the channel and for me you know donating money to me it was super awesome that you guys decided to do that um but i do want to be transparent about something because this is it, it, there's some good news and bad news um it's not exactly bad news i would say it's different than, than what was promised and it's kind of on me <laughs> so uh as you guys know which i guess apparently still some of you guys don't know and every time i mention it everyone gets super surprised but i'm 16 years old i i don't bring it up very often but like whenever i do everyone's like, oh, that's crazy. um so uh, yeah i'm 16 years old i'm going into my junior year of high school in the fall now try to picture in your mind me doing homework while i'm also running this youtube channel and now your mind is blown can't believe it wow crazy so me being 16 my biggest enemy is basically my my age okay my second biggest enemy is my age my biggest enemy is brandon's knight because he's my competition i'm just kidding i love brandon he's awesome just kidding i'm totally kidding but that that was a joke <laughs> so my biggest enemy is basically my age because uh, on the chosen multiply campaign when you signed up to make your fundraising page it did say like in bold font which i guess i have a very bad habit of skipping over all of the bold font like an incident that happened earlier that i'm not going to talk about uh with a video that i had to delete but uh, i never read the fine print which i should probably get better about and in the fine print it said you had to be over 18 in order to participate in this fundraising campaign and you know i just am i can get a little overconfident sometimes in my ability to break rules and still get away with things like i was just like well you know it just says that just because i don't I can't imagine any other kids participating in this so it doesn't matter it's fine i'll just brush over it and you know then i ended up raising sixty three hundred dollars and being able to participate as an extra in the chosen season four and then once you know the ball started rolling on that and you know the more and more details started getting unveiled uh i i come to find out it's not like the chosen just saying well you know we just don't want to have to deal with kids which at the, i was thinking i was like they just don't have to deal with like toddlers or something which is fine like i i can just be like well i can pass for an 18 year old because apparently my comment section thinks i'm a 30 year old man i didn't think it was a big deal but then you know again the ball started rolling we started getting more information and so it's like union sag rules state that you know in utah or something there's child labor laws that literally it's against the law for me to be on set for the amount of time that i would be on set if i was to be an extra in the season four finale so if i was on set the show would get fined and nobody wants that because nobody wants to have to show the pay a bunch of money and all that stuff so to come to find out that was actually the issue which <laughs> i mean i should have like expected that or thought about that somehow instead of just trying to brush over it and just being like well you know it doesn't matter i'll be in the show so it's, i'm thankful i'm thankful to all of you for helping me raise so much money for the come and see foundation awesome uh but just we uh, it's just like things are skewed so that's the bad news basically that's the bad news I, I guess it is bad news i won't get to be in the show at all for season four as an extra which is you know whatever but um, so instead I've been offered an alternative opportunity. So on July 18th, I will be visiting the set, not being in the show at all, but I will be on set, which I think is better for me personally for like the YouTube channel and stuff 
because then I can create more content surrounding it. I haven't quite asked about that yet. That, that'll just be better because the season four finale, they're keeping very secret, although we've all kind of guessed what it's going to be. It's pretty obvious. They're really kind of keeping it secret what exactly it's going to be, so everyone who is an extra on set will not be able to like film or take pictures or anything. It's gonna be top secret locked down. So for the YouTube channel, you know, that's not as good content-wise. I know Brandon Snipe and a few other people that I know from the chosen community are going to be there, and I'm very happy for everyone who's going to be there. Um, but I think probably I'm happy just for you know just to have a set visit because then like for channel purposes social media purposes much easier because it's not going to be top secret and I can't like it's not like I, I'm not allowed to have any sort of filming or anything actually again maybe I haven't asked maybe I won't be able to do anything and then I'll just be visiting set but I just wanted to, to talk about that because I know that I had some people in the comments that I'd seen who were like they you know, like you guys donated money to me, to my fundraising page on behalf of Eli Hollingsworth against the current with the intention of me being in the show, being on set for four days, filming with, you know, all the other people who were going to be there. So the fact that I'm not doing that, and this has been something, again, that's been happening for a while. Um, it's been like, I think probably a few months this has been going on. Um, uh, so uh, just re readjusting and all that stuff. So it's not necess it's not like your money was for nothing, obviously, because it's going to the Come and See Foundation and they're translating the show to more languages. So that's awesome. But I did just want to let everyone know because I didn't want to just ha have you guys in the dark and like then all of a sudden be like, well, you know, everyone else is on set and uh, I'm not. So I just figured I'd just say it now. And, you know, I haven't been keeping up with the weekly breakdowns lately. They're coming soon. I promise you. Uh, but since like we're kind of in the middle and I'm like going off, I, I just, probably as this video is out, I'm at summer camp right now. But I did just want to let you guys know. And this is this is just a little 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 appetizer to tide you guys over until I release my next weekly breakdown. So just want to let you guys know. And I want to make sure that you guys were aware of what, what exactly is going on. But do not fear because I will be on set still on July 18th. So I will be posting about that and stuff. So you guys will get content about that. I believe. I'm hopeful. <laughs> but again, thank you guys so much. From the bottom of my heart, I, it means the world to me that all of you guys decided to donate to my fundraising page on behalf of me to support the Come and See Foundation. It's just, it's amazing. It's incredible. $6,000 is a lot of money. I'll see you guys in my next video. Get used to it.